Hey, folks! Oh, well, it's time for another adventure into what's in the can. We got here large smoked oysters from Reese. These things says it's an easy open can, so it shouldn't be hard to get into this thing. Let's take a look at the nutritional facts here. Oh, not too good for you keno guys, it looks like. Total carbs, that's not good. Uh, it's uh, five grams. It's a little bit, a little bit high for you guys. Let's see what it says down here. It says, warning, consuming this product can expose you to lead and cadmium, which is known to the state of California to cause cancer and birth defects and other reproductive harm. It's a good fucking thing I don't live in California. So I'm going to eat these motherfuckers. <laughs> there's something about oysters. Now, I don't know if it's true or not, but there's a rumor. It says oysters are like the aphrodisiac. So uh, but for, for people who don't know what aphrodisiac means, it means it makes you horny as a motherfucker. That's what it means. So we're going to kill two birds with one stone here. We're going to find out what's in this can. Check it out. See if it's worth buying. I think it was... It's kind of expensive. I think it, for, for a can like this was like almost $2 at the Great Wall of Mart. Eh, a little high. But anyhow, uh, so we're going to find out what's in this can. And we're going to find out if the rumors are true. See if I got a, something to report later. Let's see what's in this thing. Let's open this mother up. Oh. Hard to get open. Okay. I've seen sardine cans before. But this looks just like a sardine sardine can. Let's open this thing. Peel that lid off. Oh, hard to peel. I just started it. Peel it back. Oh, oh, get out of there. On off there. Oh, it's got. Oh, it's juicy. It's got some juice in it. Oh, I've seen these things. And I'm not like this, but like on ice at like the Chinese restaurants. I've seen them there at the Chinese restaurants and all splayed out with the shells, and nobody's eating them. Come to think of it, I gotta tell you, I haven't been in a Chinese or any buffet, and I haven't been to one in probably. Five years. Quick little tidbit of information. I went to one with my wife and mother-in-law, my mother-in-law. We're sitting there. We're pretty close to the where you get your food. You know how they got them signs up in the air saying, like, kids under 12 must be accompanied by a parent? Well, apparently, those don't apply to some people. There's some little rat bastard running around, zipping back and forth, got a plate in his hand. Hey, 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 hey. Sipping back and forth, and then he sees the mac and cheese, and he's like, Whew. Tractor beam to the mac and cheese, right? He goes straight to the mac and cheese. He sets his plate down. He grabs a spatula spoon, shoves it in the mac and cheese. And he's looking at it, and next thing you know, he's like, Eating the mac and cheese right off of the serving spoon. Just eat it. Ow. Licking it. I was going to go, I was just about ready to tell the waitress, you know, hey, hey, you better get that fucker away from that shit. Just about that time, Big Mama sees Junior. Junior! She runs over. What are you doing, Junior? Hey, man, bag and cheese, bag and cheese. You can't do that, Junior. Give me that spoon. Big Mama takes a spoon. You know what she did? I bet you can guess. Mm hmm She took the spoon and shoved it right back in the fucking mac and cheese! No! I felt cute! No. I never went back, never went to another buffet in all my fucking life. Just shove that shit right back in the mac and cheese, waiting for the fucking next victim to go suck up her son's slimy germ juice. What the fuck's wrong with people? 
Oh. So, so anyhow, back to these fucking things. I'm gonna get the. Oh, it's weird looking. Look at that. Oh. 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 You know what? It ain't no wonder this shit's an aphrodisiac. It's got a very familiar smell. Reminds me of eating at the Y. Mm-hmm. You know the Y? Eating. Oh. Holy crap. Well, I don't know, man. Ooh. Oh yeah, it's strong. It says smoked in cherry wood. Don't smell like cherry wood to me, let me tell you. Whew, I'm gonna dig one out. Oh. 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 It looks like a Y too. Oh, it's stiff. Oh. <laughs> Why do I do this? Um, it looks, oh my god, it looks like, it looks like a, it does, and it smells like it. Holy crap. There ain't no pink in it, though. Holy shit. So anyhow, I don't know, guys. Uh, wow. This is bad. This don't. This this has got a. Yeah, I smell it from here. This has got the spam deal all over again. Oh my goodness. Fuck. Oh. Ugh. Oh, it's so. Oh my god, it's it, it can't, it can't, it's getting all over my fucking table. Drippy son of a bitch. Oh. <sighs> well, what are you going to do? Life is short. Hopefully this video will be too because this is going in. I'm going down on this bitch. Oh. Oh. You can't fake chow that, guys. There's no fake chow in that. As hard as it is, when you chew it, it just like dissolves. What in the fuck? Uh, I don't know. This shit is gross. Who the fuck eats this shit? Oh, it stinks. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do what any red blooded American would do in this case. I'm gonna put some El Yucateco extra, extra, extra hot sauce on there. I don't think there's anything that can make it taste worse unless you lay the turd on it or something. I mean, maybe some cottage cheese. <laughs> God, no! See if I can show you this. Oh fuck, the hot sauce is sliding right off of it. It don't like it either. Ugh. It didn't help it much except for make it hot, but if you guys can see this. Oh, lips right there. Got some lips. so drippy. Can't really see it right in there. That's where I put the hot sauce. Ah. Ah. 
there's like a string on that one. Mm. Like some Kotex or something. Oh, I got a tampon. Something hanging off that one. Oh. Uh. <sighs> why am I, why am I continuing to eat this shit? Oh, it's nasty. Oh, it's got a flap. It's got a flap. <laughs> oh, 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 I'm glad. I'm gonna have to wash my mustache after this. That stink's gonna be in there all day. You know how it is, guys. People with mustache and beards after they go down, they have to wash this shit. And go to work. People, what the fuck you been getting into? Trust me, if I could fake chow this shit, I'd do it. I'd be fake chowing this all over the place. Two left. Two left, guys. Ah. Yeah. Oh, my God. Oh. I'm going to have to wash my face. Well, it's not home right now, but I don't wash my face real good. I'm just going to be fucking thinking I've been hanging around with some skank, I'll tell you that. Holy crap. That's hot, okay? The heat turned on this, but I don't care. Burn the fuck out of me, I don't give a shit. Whatever you can do to take away the taste of that shit. Now what am I going to do with this can? It's got all the juice in it. That's gross. I guess, you know what, I'll just... Set it right easy, right on top, inside the trash can. That way, when wife comes home, says, "What the fuck you been doing? Where's the chicken?" I tell her it was the oysters. I should take her to the trash can and let her smell it. It'll get me off the hook. I might have found a better use for these fucking things. There's something right there. If you ever go skank hunting, you pick one up, you bring one home. You got that shit, and you can't get it out of your, get it off your face. You afraid that your wife's gonna. Come up and kiss you and get all pissed off. Before she comes home, eat some of this shit. Leave the can in the damn trash. Then when she comes home and kisses you, accuses you of doing it. You can say, I didn't do nothing. It was oysters. Go smell that shit. She'll go smell it. You're off the hook. It's like a get out of jail free card. Nice. Oh, all right, guys. I will scale a... One to ten, there's some serious flaws in this shit. First, the price. You get, well, I don't know how many ounces. 17 ounces? That's got to include the sauce in there, the oil or whatever the hell it is. Two bucks for that? Nah. And then, oh, just the taste, okay? You know, I'll tell you what. Scale of one to ten because of the flaws in this, I can't give it no higher than a three and a half. That's bad. Definitely not something you want to... Eat every day, that's for sure. I don't think I'll ever eat it again. So anyhow, if something happens, if I get horny, maybe I'll uh, cut back in. It's possible. All right, guys, I'm out. Ah! A few inches later.